Hey guys, what's going on? It's Kai. And the name. Really? Yeah. And the dogs in the background. Yeah. Sweet. That's what I asked to be good for that. Wow. So, uh, should um, we do this again? No. Okay. Um, no, keep it. We're from Pens of Gaming. Yeah, apparently. Hola. Como estas? Exactly. <laughs> My um, Spanish good. What? Well, I didn't what understand we, that. What are we doing today? Uh, we're going <laughs> to teach you guys how to download the Feed the Beast launcher. And, and install. Oh, install, sorry. And and download install. and install, yes. There you go. There's two of them, not just one. There's two. So, first things first. Uh, on your desktop. Yes, your desktop. On you're going desktop. to. You're going to. <laughs> you are going to hit control and click. What if I don't want to? Well, then you're not going to be able to do this step, and then your whole okay. computer is going to crash. Oh, man. Yep, exactly. So, you're going to hit control, click. If you're on a Mac, if you're on a Windows, video will be out later. Don't worry about this. You're going to hit control, click if you're on a Mac, and you're going to hit new folder. So, you guys can make a new folder. You're going to type in capital F, feed, space, the, capital T, space, capital B. What if I want to name it Potatoes? Well, then you're not going to be able to play the game. Oh, Sadly. okay. So, after you have that, open up your launcher, Windows, Chrome. Did I say Windows? Yes, you did. <laughs> open up uh, your uh, web browser. Um, there you go. Google Chrome, uh, Safari, right. whatever, you, whatever floats your boat. And uh, go to the www.thedane3838.com. Or uh, you can just skip right to the site if you know it. Yeah, if you know the site, you can skip right to there. But if you don't, go to the, the, the Dane site. And under where it says Server Types, Feed the Beast Unleashed, just click that, and it's a link right to the Feed the Beast site. Once oh, man. I know, it's that easy. It's like... That was so easy. <laughs> oh. <laughs> but sadly, we're not done yet. Yeah, okay. Still 800 steps. Anyway. What? Um, once you're at the Feed the Beast site, scroll down until you see Client Download. If you're on a Mac, you're going to download Jar. So just click Jar. I'd hope they'd be on a Mac. That's yes. what this whole video is for. I know, right? If you're on a Windows and you're watching this, well then... <laughs> what are you doing with your life? Stop Get watching out. this video. <laughs> just so, kidding. We'll add a link. Yes. And then you can watch that for you, you Mac people. Or not Mac. <laughs> Windows people. <laughs> can I can I go now? Yeah, you can. All right, sweet. So once you've downloaded and hit the download jar, it will download to your downloads folder. You're going to want to <laughs> minimize your... Did I say something wrong? <laughs> you just said a lot of download. Yes, download, I know. I did. Download, download, Leave me download. alone with my downloads. Okay. Minimize your window, and you're going to want to open your downloads folder. Take the Feed the Beast launcher. Sorry, I have two. Um, take the feed the beast launcher dot jar file out, put it on your desktop. You can now close your downloads file and you're gonna move your feed the beast launcher that's on your desktop to the feed the beast folder. <laughs> and right click to make sure it's in there so everything's all nice and dandy. You're then nice you can and dandy. Close that again. Oh thank you. Well, thank you. Oh, you're welcome. Um after that you either want to go to you're going to want to go to wherever your terminal is located. So, for example, mine is at the screen in my utilities folder and go to terminal. It'll open up your terminals folder. What how will how would someone find this terminal folder if they don't know where it is? I don't clue. Oh jeez. No, I'm kidding. Um go over on your right on the right side of your screen, go over to where it says uh not where it says, but it has a little magnifying glass, and if you click on it, it says Spotlight, just type in Terminal. All right. T-R-M-I-N-A-L, and it should, you know, under Applications, Top Hit, depending on if if you guys don't open Terminal a lot, then it won't be in your Top Hit. But uh, it should be under Applications, click on it, and it'll open Terminal. Next, you're going to want to, I'm not going to say this code, or this, uh, I'm just gonna say code. Um, you're not gonna. I'm not gonna say it because it's long and very annoying. So it will be in the description below. Um, open up um, pages, documents, or notes, or the text f 
file and copy and paste this in there because you will need this every time you uh, download uh, every time you want to open Feed the Beast Launcher on your Mac. If not, you will crash. Um, so I'm gonna copy and paste that in there, and I'm gonna hit enter. I feel like this video is very wordy, and I apologize for that. <laughs> you better be. So after oh, you yeah. hit that, put that uh, put that in, and hit enter. Uh, oh yeah, put the it Feed in. The Beast Launcher will pop up. <laughs> I don't even know anymore. <laughs> You're just like that background guy, aren't you? You know, just well, like, yeah. yeah. Okay. So, um, once you guys uh, have that all nice and dandied, dandied up. Uh, What's with you and dandy today? I don't know. You remember when I went through that phase of blowing people up? Oh man. Yeah, maybe. Let's not that's... start that again. <laughs> so, um, once you have that, you guys can now play Feed the Beast on a Mac. Oh sweet. Once you guys. I guess I guess the name was right. You guys have to hit launch, and it'll start downloading all the mod packs to your folder. Hopefully, it doesn't take too long for me, which it is. So we're gonna pause the video and come back when it's done. Hey guys, so we're back. Finally. Yeah, you know. It's been like five hours. Just kidding, a few minutes. <laughs> if it takes five hours, you should probably get a better connection. Yeah, probably. You might want to go cry to your internet provider. Maybe. Yeah. So, um, once you've downloaded the whole entire mod pack, yay! Oh, yeah! Click Edit Mod Pack. <laughs> and, uh, you're going to want to download or enable Biome Bill Plenty. I already have it enabled, but, uh, if you guys want to know more about it, go look at our other video, which will be in the description below. That will help you oh, out. What? As an annotation. I'll probably add it as that. Okay. I don't know what that is. I think I do, actually. But, yeah. Uh, yeah. So, um, that will go into more detail about editing a few mod packs that are optional to join the, uh, that are optional if you, you know, want hats and whatnot on the, uh, while you play I on the day server. What? I want hats. Yeah, you can have hats on the, the Unleashed pack. And so, nice. Yeah, I know. It's pretty cool. So, um, I think that's it. That's it for the video? Yeah. All right. Well, uh, everybody look out for uh, a few announcements real quick. Look out for the PC version of how to download this. Hopefully it won't be so wordy. I apologize for that. You better be. And uh, also better look be. out for the, the Dane and I's, the Dane and Kai's um, bucket Fuck. series. Yep. We are, we'll start doing that Six. eventually. Maybe. Hopefully this week we'll start. But if not, look back next week. It's currently uh, the 7th of November. So if not this week, look next week. And uh, have a great day, everybody.